Hey everybody, it's Hajigunly Pup. Last time, um, we got the fire medallion. <laughs> I could not remember what I was doing or had done for a minute there. But last time we got the fire medallion, and this time, um, let's kill this red, red dead. This time we got a couple things we have to be doing right away, and then we'll be going to a new dungeon already. Well, sort of dungeon. Micro dungeon-ish. Oh, where is Epona? No, oh, that's Lullaby. Epona! There you are. Hello! Okay, so we're gonna be going to Kakariko, I think. Yep, Kakariko. And here we are. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to an upcoming thing we're doing, but it's gonna be the last mini game that I really get annoyed with. So we're almost done with this game. Um anyway, we're almost done with this game, but we're done after probably next part, we're gonna be done with all the mini games that frustrate me, and that's awesome. Um, I actually don't need to uh, avoid saying it because <laughs> we've already done it before. It's the fishing mini game again. I have to do that twice. Um, so let's kill that. We do need to go to Death uh, to Goron City for a very important reason. There's a quick way up. You can also get the heart piece if you couldn't back up, back flip off before. Just hop off here. And we're in. So let's go down to this row. And in here, there are a couple uh, bomb walls. Take a bomb, put it down. And again. Oh, crap. Oh gosh. Um, you're enormous. I just completed a small weapon. How about it? I will buy this knife for 200 rupees. Okay. You got the giant's knife. Hold it with both hands, use B to attack, and so long you can't use it with a shield. Let's just take a look at this thing really quick. Oh yeah. I wouldn't do the that right now, though. Okay. So, that's what we need to do there. Um. So, let us go. Um. Let's play the Prelude of Light. And. We're gonna be going to Zora's Domain. Wait. No, Zora's River, right? Well, we are going to Zora's Domain, but we're going with the river first. I don't think opponent's going to be outside here, because we dropped her off at Kakariko. The Prelude of Light was just basically ugh, getting out of the <laughs> Goron City fastest. Okay. And here we go. Epona, come here. I'm trying to get a lot of stuff done within these, or within this batch of recordings. I have about an hour to do all these different things I'm trying to do. So let's get going. Um, now we have to go to Zoro's Dome, uh, River, as I said. You wait here. Ah, oh, dang it. No, don't back up. Just let me off. Okay. Ah, uh, we do need to turn at night. Ah, oh, dang it. Dang it! 
I'm trying to I'm trying to save time by mashing the buttons out and I'm failing miserably. Okay. Now there are a couple things we can get here. Let's just ride this up and leap off. And right over there, we can see a Golden Skulltula. Very good. Um, I think there's probably just... I think there's just 20 rupees in this hole. Twenty rupees, huh? Now, inside this rock, or underneath this rock, is a fairy fountain. Uh, don't do that right now because it's not a great fairy fountain. It's just a place to refill your bottles, and you're gonna need to empty your bottles very soon. Um, I'm trying to remember if there's something else we need to do here. Oops. Um. Yep, okay. Oh crap, I was looking away. Ha! Oops. Let's go back up. So, if we cross this bridge, we should be able to hear... Oh no, okay. Skulltula, where are you? Oh, there it is. Very good. Carefully leap off. Don't go in that water. We have to climb up again. Okay. So let's go back into Zora's domain. La la la. I can't sing. So, let us leap inside. And, like everything in the seven years, this one has changed it a lot. In fact, I think it's changed the most. It's completely covered in ice. That's not good. Let's see how King Zora's doing. King Zora? He is frozen solid. Fantastic. So, let's come over here and carefully walk to the edge. You know, when I say carefully, I mean carefully, because it's freaking ice. And... Crap, I think it has to be night. There should be a skull right here. Dang it! Ugh. Sun song. And, of course, I'm inside, so... Takes me back to the entrance. Is there a skull tool up there now? Yep, right there. See if I can hit it. Oh yeah! <laughs> Let's go up and claim our reward. That was actually pretty good. Carefully walk over the edge. And... Hey! Not fair. Okay. So, let's... Since the king is out of the way, we can just go behind him. Very simple. <clears throat> okay. And this is not frozen, so that's good. Okay. Okay. Now, when I practiced this, I had so much trouble with this for some reason, because I didn't want to wait. But waiting is your key here. You need to do some ice... ice pla Can't even finish what I'm trying to say. You have to do some ice platforming. And it's very difficult. Sometimes Link just doesn't want to jump. Always try to roll before you get to an edge. Okay, now just wait here and then leap like that. That's what I was having so much trouble doing. Oh, yeah. Also, those guys have screwed me so many times. <laughs> there we go. Heart piece. I think that's a new heart. No. Not even close, actually. 
And let's see if we can go back. No, no, no! Problem is you can't pull yourself up on this. So you have to go all the way back. Octorok, move out of the way. Okay. Leap. Oh, okay. Where do I go? Right here. Leap. 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 And leap. There we go. Welcome to the new dungeon. The Ice Caverns. And you're going to... Well, this is actually a pretty short dungeon. Um, no boss, which is nice. Uh, it's, it's like a mini dungeon. Um, what I think just you do here is just go into the center of the room. You have to fight all these guys, but you can just use a Din's Fire and take them all out. Almost all of them. <laughs> okay, and watch out for that thing, because the thing will mess you up. Actually, isn't there a... Skulltula somewhere here? Um... No, not in this room. Okay. In this room, I believe. Yep, right there. Okay. How many Skulltulas do we have? 68, wow. Um... Let's grab... We have to, Our goal for this is to grab all of these, um... Silver rupees. I missed that one. This thing, I believe, will freeze you if you touch it. Which is not fun. And is also why I'm running around it. Leap up here. Up here. And... Last one. Oh no, it didn't freeze me. Never mind. Just does damage. Minor damage. Okay. Just keep making our way through this. And... Okay. These freaking keys. These are ice keys. And they are going to mess you up. Also, these guys will try to mess you up. By freezing you. There's a lot of things that can freeze you in this dungeon. The one up there. Um. There's another one somewhere. I hear it. Don't see it. I see the ice melty guys. Or ice freezy guys. Okay. We're going to empty all of our bottles, sadly. Now, you don't need to do this, but trust me, you don't want to keep going back and forth to these rooms. Um, I'm going to use a fairy. I'm actually going to go up there and use a Din's Fire first before I use heal my magic. Dang it. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Stop that, Link. Burn. Yes, yes, blue fire. Okay. And we'll seize it one more time. Oh yeah, keys. You die. Think they'll kill that thing too? No, it did not. Oh no. Okay. Come on. Let's use our potions. Our red potion. And what blue fire does is it melts uh, extremely cold ice, which is the red ice. So, we can grab some blue fire here, 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 and here. 
Very good. Um, so let's go across this. Carefully across this. And blue fire. I wonder what it'll be. Okay. And now we have the map, and you can see how tiny this dungeon is. Um, it's very small. Let's grab some more blue fire. And continue on. Let's go back to that spinny room. If I can get... How did I get through that without taking a single hit? That was insane. Okay, so. Let's go this way. Melt this red ice. And. Inside. We get. Some. Fun. With keys and low frame rate. Wow, that was bad. <laughs> okay. Blue fire. And some more blue fire. You can also hear a Sculptula here. Let's get that. As soon as we open this. Or <laughs> break that down and get a heart piece. Um, there is a Sculptula right here. Okay. And there's also... A compass! Which shows how much how little we have left in this dungeon. This dungeon, I also recommend you have all four bottles. Uh, you don't have to do the poet mission right away, but it's it'll make your life so much easier if you have four bottles. Okay. Oops. Hurry. Break that. Okay. Okay, there is a block puzzle here we have to do. Um, first, there's actually a Skulltula somewhere. Somewhere here. Thought it was in this. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, geese! Okay. Skulltula. I think that's the last one in this uh, cave or dungeon. So, what we need to do with this is push it somewhere. I believe it's push it right here. Climb up on this and grab this. We have to get, of course, more of these stupid silver rupees. Climb up here. Can I knock it onto that? I think I can if I backflip. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> what a backflip! Okay, and carefully, I don't know if I can make this leap. Hup, nope, can't do that. Okay, can I even get up there? No. Okay, keys, go away. No one likes you. Again, ah. Uh, hate keys. Okay, screw it. He's gone now. Um, thing is, if I push this any other direction, it's gonna go in a hole. Hmm. Oh well. Let's let's get a new one. New pallet. Oh, he's coming back. Nope. Denied. Oh come on. Parkour is not easy to do in this game. <laughs> well, 
Not saying that it's easy to do in real life, just... <laughs> just saying it's very difficult to do in this game. Crap, I think I need um, some more blue fire. You need to leave this dungeon with two blue fire bottles. I'm actually already up on time, so let's just try to finish up this dungeon. I want to get it done before I end this part. Might not be able to, though. Okay. Rush over here. And we can hear some more blue fire. And if we play the Song of Time... We can get these rupees that were sitting here taunting us. If we jump right. Gonna refill a little bit on uh, blue fire. Do -do -do -do. Okay. Didn't I get all the rupees? Why isn't the door open? What? Um. What? I didn't get that one. Are you kidding me? I put the blue fire down. Ugh. <sighs> really? Grab the stupid rupee. There we go. I'm actually recording this pretty close to when it's supposed to be up. I'm recording this on Sunday, and this is Wednesday's video, so... <laughs> um, I have completely lost my aheadness in videos. Um, I've been playing a lot of South Park Stick of Truth. That is... Well, I actually beat it. I'm playing through again to try to get all the achievements. Uh, that is an amazing game. But... Let's keep going through here. Now, I you don't you can't I think you can line it up, but you can just easily leap and grab. Walk by everything. And melt. Okay, I think we have one extra blue fire that we don't need. You know what? Screw it. Let's switch to the giant's knife for this fight. Boom! That is the kind of power we have with the giant's knife. Can kill a huge wolfos in one hit. But look at this. Doesn't even do any damage to his uh, chest at all. Nope. Big sword. We paid 200 rupees for that. We meet again, HL. If you came here to meet the Zoras, you wasted your time. This is all there is. With one expectation, the Zoras are now sealed under this thick sheet. Uh, this thick ice sheet. I managed to rescue the Zora princess from under the ice, but she left to head for the water temple. This ice is created by an evil curse. The monster in the water temple is the source of the curse. Unless you shut off the source, the ice will never melt. If you have courage enough to comfort, uh, to confort, to to confront the danger and save the Zoras, I will teach you the melody that leads to the temple. Time passes, people move like a river's flow; it never ends. A childish mind will turn to noble admission. Young love will become deep affection. The clear water surface reflects growth. Now listen to the serenade of water to reflect upon yourself.
you have learned the serenade of water. HL, I'll see you again. Thank you all for watching, and please subscribe. Next time, we're going to track down that freak who gave us a defective sword. Thank you all for watching. And next time, I already said what we're going to be doing. So, and I will see you as soon as, or I will say my final goodbyes as soon as we leave this area. Bye.